It's time now for Better Health. I'm joined here with Asante's health expert, Beth Coker. Beth, today we are talking about stomach cancer. So kind of break down, what are some of the warning signs of it? Many of us will experience a stomach ache at one time or another, and it doesn't mean that we're developing stomach cancer. Mm -hmm. Many of the symptoms that turn into stomach cancer can be misdiagnosed as just general gastrointestinal or GI tract disorders, bloating, some heartburn, a feeling of being full all the time, or just general nausea. But sometimes stomach cancer is misdiagnosed because those early onset of mm -hmm. symptoms are missed until a very advanced stages. But the good news is stomach cancer in the United States is on the decline mm. because we can now diagnose the H. pylori infectious bacteria earlier and treat stomach cancer. So some of the symptoms you're gonna see in people with stomach cancer is a decrease in weight immediately and a loss of appetite. They mm. report just differences in their bowel habits, recurrent diarrhea or constipation, extreme fatigue due to the loss of blood and anemia that has set into them. And they just feel full after eating a very small mm. amount of food. So these are the, some of the warning signs that doctors are looking for in patients and then to further look into stomach cancer. Talk to me a little bit about what the risk factors are of stomach cancer. It can be anything, smoking is the big one. Okay. And males tend to get stomach cancer more frequently than females do. Anyone who is overweight or obese runs a risk of stomach cancer. Mm. People who have had surgeries for stomach ulcers previously are at a higher risk of stomach cancer. If you have a genetic disorder or a family history of stomach cancer, that's another risk factor. And then diet plays in hugely yeah. with stomach cancer risk. People who eat a diet high and smoked fish, any kind of smoked feet and cured meats, they kind of erode the lining mm. of your stomach and you're much more prone to stomach cancer. Is there any treatments for it? There is treatment if it's diagnosed early okay. enough. And what doctors and providers really recommend is eating a diet more plant-based. Limit the intake of meat, which is very acidic and can erode things. Don't smoke. There are many preventive things you can yes. do on our end of it not to develop stomach cancer. Okay. But once you think that you have some of these symptoms, get in to see your doctor, get diagnosed so you can get on the right treatment and back to health. Perfect, good stuff, Beth, thank you. We'll be right back.